In this video, I'm showing my colony of Suriname roaches, also known as the greenhouse cockroach. They are originally from South and Southeast Asia, but they have become invasive in tropical and subtropical regions around the world. They are a burrowing species of cockroach. Out of the nearly 4,000 species of known cockroaches, only around 40 are pests, and this species is one of them. They get introduced to homes when people bring in new plants and they're in the soil. They get their nickname the Greenhouse Cockroach because they're commonly found in greenhouses. My original colony actually came from my greenhouse. I collected probably about 20 of them, and now I have a few hundred if not close to a couple of thousand. This species of roach is all female. They reproduce through a process known as parthenogenics, which is a process of self-cloning. So in theory, it only takes one cockroach to start a colony with these. For my substrate, I use a mix of worm castings and Scylla jungle mix. And I also add in some leaf litters like dried oak leaves and some decaying wood. But any kind of substrate, they can easily burrow and will work. I keep the warm side of their bed in the high 80s to around 90 degrees. I feed them any kind of fruit and vegetables that I offer to my other cockroaches. They can be used as a feeder roach. But due to them burrowing against the substrate quickly and they're able to become a household pest, I don't like to use them as feeders. So instead I use their bin as a compost bin. This is probably one of my favorite species to keep. They're very low maintenance, so all I have to do is give them enough substrate to burrow in and keep them fed. And before long the population will explode. Since they're all female and reproduce asexually, I don't have to worry about the ratio of male to female. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Let me know what you think of these roaches in the comments, and make sure you like and subscribe.